Welcome everyone to this week's episode of Ringside Insanity here on the Casa Team Studios YouTube channel. I am the Meech Machine, or whatever nickname you want to give me this week, Jeff Meacham. Machine Hogan. Purple. Such an enthusiastic introduction to yourself. Good job, Jade. I'm tired. It's been, a, it's been a long week and it's only Wednesday. It's only hump day here on the channel. And we are here because we watched another movie featuring a wrestler, starring a wrestler this time, actually. Not just featuring, starring a wrestler. A, a, a movie of, of, of legendary status, if you will. That was the worst pun ever, but it's okay. Legendary starring Patricia Clarkson, John Cena, Danny Glover, and I forget the kid's name, but the one that played John's brother in the movie. Um... This, I, I've gone back and forth on Legendary because I, I this is the second time I've watched it now. I I think I agree with JJ now. This is my favorite John Cena movie that I've watched so far. And I know that you are partial to the Marine. And I, I've still yet to see 12 Rounds. you got to watch that one for review, too. But um, of the two, between Legendary and the Marine, I think Legendary... I think I think John showed more of his acting chops in this. He showed more of a dramatic performance. I, th I think he had a broader range of acting in this one than he did in the Marine. Marine was pretty much, you know, my wife got kidnapped. I'm pissed off about it. I'm gonna start shooting bad guys and kicking bad guys. But you know, legendary, there was much more depth to the character of Mike than there was to the character of um, John Triton in the Marine. Um, and, you know, Patricia Clarkson's amazing, you know, Academy Award winner, Danny Glover's an Academy Award I think the nominee or winner, you know, just a great story, a great story of, you know, a family coming together at the end, of course, you know, it's a great dramatic movie, um, I, I thoroughly enjoy it every time, and I, you know, I'm glad that I got it on DVD for either my birthday or whatever I got it for, I'm glad it's in my collection. Your turn. <laughs> you just look at me. You don't even say, okay, it's your turn. You just... Hmm? <laughs> hey, if, if Siska Lieber can have a good transition like that, <laughs> you know, and of course, you know, one's dead and one's, you know, whatever Roger Ebert is these days. What? Whatever Roger Ebert is these days. I don't no, know. I, I, I know he's not dead, but, you know, whatever. Anyway. Like, wasn't he the one that lost all the weight? Yeah, I think so. The other one's the taller one, right? Right, right, right. right. Gene, okay. Gene's the one that died, but Roger Ebert did lose weight. I don't know if he gained it all back or what, but the the, sh the show is gone. I know that. The show's not on the internet. Yeah, anymore, I know. So Ebert and Robert Sucks. didn't last very long. They lasted a long time. What are you talking about? The, the, the one without Gene Siskel? Yeah. Not, not too long, really. Anyway, well, your yeah. thoughts on Legendary? I think it's a really sweet movie. Sweet story. I mean, not movie. Story. Snoring. Wow. Story. <laughs> Did it make you snore? <laughs> Everything is making me snore right now. That's right. Um, I think it's a really good, well put together and taught. Uh, taught. Talked. Not talked. <laughs> That's what I'm trying to do. Uh, well put together and well acted and. Well thought out. Thank you. There we go. Thank you for that. Don't push me. Don't push you. <laughs> that was never my intention to push you <laughs> this time. Hey. Um, yes, I am partial to the Marine, but I do think this is a really good story. Um, being a mother of a son of son myself, you know, and having, you know, my dad do jail time and all that, mm. it kind of got, you know, to my heart, right. you know, so, it, it's a really good movie, and I do recommend it, I think that, you know, especially if you have the same problems that I've had, right, in my family, you'll relate to it, and you'll love it for that. Yeah, see, I never, I never had these problems, I, I, I was in the freaking Brady Bunch house, except there were, like, yeah, not, th there were not six kids three from each, I mean, we, it was my brother, my father, my mother, and me, we all had the same, you know, it was, it was one and family. And he didn't all get along, though. <laughs> you said Eddie didn't get along. Oh, no! <laughs> oh, no. We can only bear now that I moved out. 
<laughs> Seriously, the week after Father's Day was like the best week we've had, I think, since I moved out of there. We all got... Yeah, seriously, it was like the Brady Bunch up there in Santa Cruz for a week, man. There was no fighting. There was no drama. It was amazing. Same as my family. As soon as we all moved out, yeah, we got along. I know. My sister and I are like best friends now. And yep. My mom... Uh, yeah, seriously, your, your mom's biggest problem is the fact that your do her, her dog's uh, private parts are having issues. Right. Yeah, poor bear. Seriously. Aww. I know. But, you know, with... With with legendary, I think that it's getting in trouble. <laughs> it's our show. I don't really care. <laughs> there was our side before there was a Constantine studio there, buddy. <laughs> so. <Yeah. laughs> um, legendary, I think, was perfect for John to transition from the action star phase of his. Yes. Because he did. Even though he did a little bit of action in that in the movie too. Well, it's a Some couple of fight a couple of brief fight scenes at the end of the day, like very brief. I mean, very one sided, both of them. But with the Marine and then the Marine two, I mean, twelve rounds. You know, it's it's, it's the same story. I haven't seen it, but come on, the wife gets in trouble. He has Marine to go Marine two sucked. I I I haven't seen him DBS. So. I can wait for the Marine three. No. Oh, yeah. I can wait. No. And I'm going to. Forever. Because oh. I'm not going to see it. Oh, well, it has a wrestler. Nope. As long as the show's on. As long as the show's on the I area. will quit the show. That'll be the last time you have to see me. You'll have. They'll be happy. I, th I, th I thought last time was going to be the one with all, the, all our buddies in the clown movie. I'm not watching that either. It's two movies she refuses to watch. She doesn't care enough about y'all. Nope. Well, she admits it. <laughs> but... I thought I thought Legendary was a great transition. I thought that both Twelve Rounds and the and the Marine, you know, showed that he could, you know, do the do the the, the big stunts and do all the action stuff. But Legendary. So are we reviewing the Marine too now? Or the Marine too? No, I'm talking about John Cena. <laughs> we kind of just did a. <laughs> hey, if you, I was if making you, a comparison. If you're reviewing it like, on this show, too, you won't have to watch it. What, the Marine? Yeah. I want to watch they the Marine again. <laughs> I like the Marine. I had no problem with the I Marine. I liked it until they started playing it too much on cable. That's why you don't watch it on cable, because they freaking... I'm sorry, I saw John and I'm like, ooh, hi. Freaking women, man, seriously. It's John. Freaking women, man, seriously. It's John. Freaking women, man, seriously. John. Legendary is... It's definitely a, a, a switch for him, and I thought he did very well. And I think the other actors and actresses definitely complimented his um, his style. Now that he's done action and a drama, though, mm -hmm. I want to see him in a comedy. Oh, definitely. I would love to see I the think Goober side that seriously. we all know that he has. Definitely. Definitely. Come out. Yes. Well, hopefully, hopefully that'll happen soon. Right now they're sticking with comedies with uh, with the big show, and you know we don't know how that one. Did, did Edge do a comedy or is it a comedy drama? I think I, I think it's a dramedy because Jamie Kennedy's in it. We all know Jamie Kennedy, you know, is mm -hmm. mostly a comedic actor, but we haven't seen it yet. Except for Scream. We will soon. Except for Scream. Scream was funny. No. Yes, it was. Oh, well, oh you got it. There you go, baby. Scream. Very good. All right. Well. What's the next one we're doing? Um, I believe the next one's going to be. Uh, oh, that's right, next week! <laughs> that's right, we are one week from America's Independence, hence the shirt, I probably should wear this next week, Yeah. but uh, I'll, wear, I'll wear my Hulk Hogan shirt next week, because next week on the show is the review of the, the timeless classic, Oscar-worthy piece, First Time on DVD! No Holds Barred. We're going to watch that in the next week. Much to Jade's chagrin, and we'll let you know what we think about it. Jade will have more than two words to say. I promise. I hate the movie. Four. There you go. There's four words. Give it. You said, a, you said you more need than to give two. It, you need to give it a fair <laughs> chance. I have three more. She's gonna say, huh? It had Debo. That's right. That's the only good thing. Debo in his acting debut, or close to it. We'll first to, feature role, I yeah, think. Yeah, first feature role. We'll have to <laughs> we'll, we'll have to go back and see how many he did before No Holds Bar. But in the meantime, 
If you haven't watched Legendary yet, we definitely recommend it. Five out of five for me. Great movie. Great flick. I'm saying that straight for the first time on the show. Oh. <laughs> my back was starting to hurt being slashed over like that. So I give oh it. A, I give it a five out of five. Six. Six out of five. No. You've been doing ten. okay the entire run of the show. You've been doing five. No, I haven't. I've been to ten. Has she? I thought I thought I, thought I was doing you the ten. You were a five. I was ten. Oh my bad. Okay, so 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 six Get out of ten. Get out of my case for his boo boo. So, so does that make you yogi? If I'm boo boo. Ow, sunburn! Ow, god damn! Oh. Bye. See y'all next week.